Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Backyard Bandits. So all of our mechs are repaired and back. We'll go to the command center real quick. Or, sorry, to the mech bay, not to the command center. So the mech bay, uh, what do we do here? So the archer, we didn't get anything in the archer. Centurion, I added the, uh, where is it here? The defense gyro. Uh, it's one of the few mechs and we can actually put gyros in. Can't put anything in here, can't put anything in here. Uh, the bushwhacker um, has already got a defense gyro, so that got put, or that was put in there too as well. Um, uh, we couldn't put anything in the Minshin. The Mortis got the double plus defensive gyro uh, because it's going to be in for melee, and once we get a bigger engine, and it's it's really going to need this. So the bonus uh, against being hit, evasion pips gain from music. Uh, movement and plus one max ev evasion pips will be nice once this thing's moving a little faster but for right now at least the defense will be nice for this thing moving in close um, so the centurion I'm not really sure if I showed you the re reload out on this guy it's got the ultra 10 with three tons of ammo uh, and a pair of MRM 10s with the MRM Apollo uh, the targeting computer with an Artemis and battle computer long range so I'm hoping that this guy at kind of medium ranges um, so like 500 meters or 540 meters or so, that's where he'll stay. That's kind of a, a good range for him. Um, that targeting computer, the bonus long range, uh, a chance to hit and all that, will really be advantageous for this mech. Um, fingers crossed, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, the Men Shen, uh, no, uh, the Bushwhacker, we, I, we put the uh, range finder in this guy um, because I want that Gauss to hit more often, so having good line of sight on people is, a, is uh, always better. So we're going to run. I'm not really sure about the second Lance yet. Um, we're going to go to the command center because we've got two missions. We've got a, a three skull and a three and a half. Now the way our two and a half skulls have been working, we've been pretty easy to do. But this one, distraction, looks like there's going to be a couple of Lances for sure. Um, so you move in, you fight the first lance, and then reinforcements will arrive, you kill them. Now, at three skulls, if we get mediums and heavies, that second lance, I don't know, um, might survive it. I don't, I, I don't know. And then hot landing is three, is three and a half skulls, which we're for sure we're going to get at least one heavy mech in here, maybe a couple. Um, but once again, um, this is a battle in the tundra. Uh, is a heavy lance been inserted in the uh, uh, planet surface by a Mark dropship. We should be able to do that with our main lance. Um, but I'm not really sure about this one for the second lance. i got to think about it. See if they're... I, I think they're probably capable. I don't know. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and take hot landing today. Uh, see how we do with this one. And it's going to be a heavy lance, heavily armed, expect strong resistance. So we're going to take the main lance for sure with this. We're almost maxed out with the pirates here. Hopefully these next few missions will get maxed out with the pirates. I don't know what that's going to get us. Um, I don't think the pirates can actually fully control the system, but if the pirates um, get up to a certain percentage um, in the planet area, it might actually open up ability to uh, to uh, for us to um, grab some uh, stuff in, the, in a pirate store. I don't know. I, I'm gonna we're gonna attempt it and see what happens. So we're gonna go ahead with the main lance. Let's see how we do. All right, let's see where they put us. Okay, we got some helpers, but doesn't look like good helpers. Only good Merrick is a dead Merrick. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so they're up in the hills over here. At least we're on the hill, which is kind of nice. We don't have to fight our way up. All right, let's get up a little higher here. Roger that. Confirmed. Moving to position. So we got four vehicles with us. Does it really matter what they are? Come on, guys. Moving on up. Let's get up this hill. What do we got here? Um, we've got Plainsmen, SRMs, LRM-5, large laser. I'm just looking for long-range stuff. Another Plainsman. Another plainsman. Okay, well. How can I help? Heads up, Commander. Oh shit! You've got hostile contacts inbound. Archer, hunchback, fire, 
Oh, excuse me. Fire started and a mur uh, vulture mark two. Really? Okay, keep going up. Let's get up high. Um, you need to close though. Let's get into yeah. Moving to position. Let's get evasive. Uh, they're supposed to be over there. Affirmative. Okay, these were supposed. To, these guys are the reinforcements, I think. Do we drop behind the reinforcements, which is kind of really nice. We don't have a direct line of sight though, which is kind of sucky, but it still gives us the option to shoot at them from the rear. If we can't see them, they can't see us. Do we need to move? Probably should. Alright, let's see what we're looking at here. That's pretty darn good. Archer 2R. It's an upgrade. Hunchback. Well, sure. He's the dangerous one, I'm guessing. Okay, nice shots. Although I guess if we wanted a quick kill, the hunchback would have been the, the smart choice, but whatever. So they're going to have eight guys for sure. We already knew that. All right, we lost our chance on him. I've got your back. Got my back. Just get the hunchbacks back. Do some significant damage to this guy. I'll switch out of the arrows. Standard ammo. Here it comes. Affirmative. Okay, it penned. Nice. Punch right through his armor. Open up for a little bit of uh, Queen Bee shenanigans. Oh, somebody's got a mortar. Damage is light. Reporting. Minimal damage. Acknowledged. Dude, we gotta fix your speed. You got the right weapons, just no speed. Our Queenie. Standing by. Let's get as close as we can without seeing them. Copy that. Brace here. And then we're gonna go in for a strike. See if we can clean these guys up before that main lance gets here. They kind of dropped us in a good position too, which is nice. It's really nice. Here comes those lerms. Oop. Reporting heavy damage. Yeah, someone's got some swarms or something. Yeah, clump up so that uh, Hunchback is more level to shoot at you. What the hell is that? That's somebody from back there? It sounded like it. I wonder if they're going to wait for their uh, teammates. That would probably be the smart thing to do. Moving out. Thirty-nine. Two larges and four flamers. That's an interesting loadout. Two machine gun arrays. Oh my God! This guy's got to die. 
two streak MRM thirties. Shit. That's making me reconsider my life choices. Now I'm, Standing by. I'm worried about dropping down there. Like if we send I Queen B it. down there. If we send B down there, she's going to be... There's a potential for her to be in a lot of trouble. And yet, I'm really hoping we salvage a lot off this mech. Regardless, we're taking mech parts. Good thing we got the height, though. Do we risk it, though? Do we send B down there? Nah, not with a hunchback. Screw you and your damn mortars. My thought was to um, pull off one of these shenanigans. Roger that. We're gonna pull off some shenanigans. We might as well pull off some shenanigans. Here it comes. Got the angle. Taking the shot. Hopefully you guys enjoy that barrage. I'm hoping that that um, vulture can't get a good angle on her. What the hell is that sound? Alright, shooting his lasers. Nice. Okay, she goes on 17. Not too bad. Not too bad. It's the same turn as the Vulture. Yeah. What's the flank? You got six chevrons. Relax. Oh shit, Arachne goes 20. Which means their Vulture might go before us. When do our vehicles go? 14, 13, I don't know. Hopefully they've got another mech back there that goes yes, before. Oh, we can only hope. All right, let's make sure we tag the vulture here. That's the hunchback. There's the vulture. All right, firing. Oh yeah. Okay, that was one of theirs. Aye, aye. All right, B. Hardcore, you know the score. Rear armor it is. Yes, that worked out. Engaging jump jet. Okay, we got lucky there. Oof. Well, you know one of the streaks hit. I've got your back. This guy's got to go away. Copy that. That was a critical hit, lad. Yeah, we're about to fuck him up. What is that sound? Orders. Moving out. Dude, I'm about to make your life some hell. Right after this. 
you're not going to be feeling so well. Oop, let's bring you down and let's change you to acid. And uh, yeah, let's give them the what for. See ya. Okay, I feel better now. I feel better now. Uh, we're not going to get much salvage off that guy, but at least one of the streaks is intact. Oh, man, could you imagine if that guy got up here and unloaded on us? I thought we picked up a Vulture 2 part from somewhere. Did we not do that yet? Maybe not. Ah, well, there goes our vehicle. Enjoy it, boys. Do we have enough resolve? I want B to jump back in and go after that uh, um, hunchback again. The archer we can easily handle. Um, that's a side strike. Can we burrow through this guy? What are we looking at here? 90, 60, 80. He's taking a bit of back damage. Um, better chance on the hunchback, but we're going to kill him from behind. So let's go after this guy. We'll get Hopper to follow that up. Get the Hopper to follow that up. Uh, yeah, same guy, please. Roger. Oh, yeah! Battle neck down. wonder if he was running an XL. He may, have, he may well have been running an XL engine. What was that, a Centurion? AC2 carrier. Standing by. Makes me wonder if, there, if that might be a Lance of Vehicles over there. Make sure we're in close to these guys. Let's go ahead and vigilance. Can't forget to do that. And then we'll hammer this guy. Target lock on enemy's rear. Only two hits though. We'll get another shot at him before we before we jump back up, so. I'm almost considering switching the flamers out to X pulses. We've got enough of them now. Location confirmed. How's about we give this guy the big fuck you? Eh? What's up, buddy? Target's taking a critical hit. Nobody shoots my bee in the back. You know what I'm saying? You don't shoot my bee in the back. Yeah, thanks for being here. Your attendance is uh, appreciated. Yep. Yep. He's pretty much had it. What is that sound? Why did it say failed shutdown? Oh, are they using a, some kind of EMP to shut my mech down? What are they doing? Gallant Mark III. Yes, Commander. They must be using something bizarre. Alright, neither of those guys are worth it. Now it's the, the, the AC2 carrier. He's going to go down by the Black Knight. 32 on the AC2 carrier. He's got two flak and standard. What's this guy? Machine guns. ERPPC Magna and LRM-20 Delta. That's a lot of armor. That's a bit more easy to manage. We'll get rid of it first. Go after that guy first and try to get rid of him. Alright, Hopper. 
close the gap a little bit with these guys. Oh, what do we got back there? Is that a Bombard or a Blackjack? Oh, Jager mech. Oh, interesting. Let's just try and get rid of this carrier. Okay, not bad. We can use incendiary on him next round. Hopefully, blow him up. All right, B. Let's just, uh, oh, did he face me? Of course he did. You chicken shit. We'll go. <laughs> Nobody will fault you for bailing out, buddy. That was a bit ridiculous. Somebody's got a rack over there. Good to go. Super sharp shooter shooting shots. Fuck him. Going down. Solid connection on. Just bail out guy. <laughs> <laughs> it just looks so funny how heavily he went down. Okay, 10 heat. Stressing out. Don't blame you, buddy. He's pretty much done. What is that noise? Ordered. Climb a bit. We're going to keep going up, get a little bit more height. Wolverine, okay. Wolverine! Let's get rid of this carrier if we can. I know I said I was going to switch to incendiary, but I forgot. Because that's how I do. The Wolverine looks so tiny. How can I help? Moving at Keep gaining some height. We, want, want, we don't want these guys to out-height us. 8% in the Wolverine, eh? Well, in the Jager mech. All right, well. On I know the heat's not going to make a difference to that guy, but we got to hit him with something. Yep. Beautiful. What is that... Freaking noise! It's gotta be that vehicle. This vehicle is doing something. Ready to get it on. Um. That's your full sprint, huh? Let's move. Christ is like you're crawling up the hill, dude. Yes, Commander. Copy that. Get eyes on here in a second. That'll change things around a bit. At least our little buddies are moving up. Yes, Commander. Alright, let's see what we can get on this vehicle now. Um... Lots of incendiary, so let's use that. Copy that. Nice. So we got the potential for some good salvage out of this. I, I'm interested to see how many parts of that vulture would survive, though. It didn't look like we blew up his CT, although it felt that way, if that makes any sense. It felt like we CT'd him. Yeah, we're poking. We're poking. 
99 with incendiaries. <laughs> yeah, fuck them. Oh man. Got something you want done? Oh, you can get some sight on. Surprise I think it's the X pulses, probably. No, it's the tags. <laughs> See if we can get this guy with the tags. Oh, we got one on him. Okay. Commander. Uh, we can't quite get there, eh? Can we get to a place where they can't see us? Like here? Affirmative. Let's get this barrage back up. And we'll brace here. I want to see if we can barrage either the vehicle or the Jagermech. Wolverine I'm not too worried about. Once he gets close to the Black Knight, Black Knight's just going to shred him. What the hell is that thing doing? You guys are hearing that sound too, right? It's like every time that guy goes to do something, you hear some weird noise. Um, can't get any higher than that, huh? Oh, you can get over here. Indirect on the guy down there, though. Why all of a sudden... All right, whatever. Let's try and get rid of this guy. He's making those weird sounds and I I just get the feeling it's something bad. It's got like a really low percent chance to do something. I don't know. Oh, so you got the rack five probably. Could be a rack two, but it's probably a rack five. Oh, the Jagermax got some speed to it for 65 tons. Ready for orders. Full speed ahead. We gotta get some bigger cores. I've got your back. Yeah, see that guy must have moved. Probably doesn't want to be in a direct line of sight, and you know what? I don't blame him. I better move though. Let's get a firing line going. They don't have any mortars or anything, so. Um, oh God, how close is he dying to this on this side? I don't even know what we're hitting here. Let's just fire. Here we go. He's got so much armor. Come on, you guys. Show him what you can do. Awaiting orders. Prepping for jump. All right, let's share some love with these guys. Look, we haven't forgot about you guys, okay? Wow, way lower on this guy, eh? Uh, he's got probably two AC5s, two AC2s, and pardon me, so it's a stock loadout. This guy's got two energy that aren't working. Uh, let's barrage. It's 65 on both these guys, so it doesn't really matter which one. Let's go after this guy. Okay. The heat's not going to affect it. Either of those two max it won't really matter, but it's really just the barrage that I want. If we can get enough heat in the Jager mech, slow it down a little bit. Okay, didn't make the noise that time. Twenty-three Wolverine. Wolverines. That's why you don't use the mask anymore. Don't, this guy's running. Screw you! Firing. Hit. We'll get you now with Hopper. 
Although I will say, with Queen B jumping in and getting close to mechs and using her flamers, uh, unless they move oh, really, really slow, she's been doing a, or they've been doing a really good job of getting out of her arc of, of fire so that she can't fire again and then jump out. For the most part. Not always, but most of the time they do. Um, don't miss. Just don't miss, okay? Please don't miss. Okay, you didn't hit us. That's good. Standing by. Not hitting teammates is always a win. All right, firing. Taking the shot. Ah, two more hits. It's fine. Confirm. Okay. How can I help? You know what you need to do, buddy. Let's remove this guy. It's a problem. Aye, aye. Oh my God. There's times when that clustering is beautiful, and then there's times when it's just not. What is that? It's got to be the missile systems that it's firing. Yeah, a little bit of damage. On Arachne. We'll get these other guys later, but this guy's got to go. Well, he's doing a good job of torso twisting, that's for sure. I know it's not a mech, but. Oh, you want to play the game, eh? Do you want to see who's got the bigger gun? We can play that game. That's cool. I got, I got, I got a gun here we can test out on you. Let's try this one. It's called Big Gun in the Face. Wow. Must have ECMs or something going on here. Alright, firing. Tags are on. Oh, the big one hit. There you go. Inflicted some heavy damage. It's a heavy rotary Hi, five. Oh, it's gone. We blew his arm off. Ah. Well. Let's just go with the better chance to hit. He's wobbly too. Ooh, four hits. Talk to me. Please. Just finish this guy off. Target confirmed. Nope. Because of course not. We've decided we're going to take all of his armor off first before killing the inside of him. Well, he just blew up. <laughs> what was that noise? <laughs> what the hell was that noise? Yeah, then he explodes. It's, it, I don't know, it's got to be some kind of experimental weapon or something. Only one hit, huh? Alright, well. Doing your job, it's all you, it's all you can do. Seriously? You did see what happened to the last guy, right? Alright, this guy's dead. Hammer him. Oh no. Inflicted some heavy damage. Yes, Commander. Alright, can we get a bit of Ah, we get a bit of a nope. higher a little bit higher. Maybe? No, not really. I think we actually went down slightly. Alright, hammer him. Oh. Liking those arms. Reporting critical hit. Like in those arms. Okay, let's remove the Wolverine. 
Maybe. Yep, there you go. Yeah, I know, but we don't really want that mech anyway. We want the Vulture, remember? We get that guy intact with a pair of <laughs> Streak MRM 30s. You know what you're taking, Hopper. That's going to be your mech. Ah, well. Oh, well. Tango down. There it is, folks. Mission successful. So we've gotten really lucky with our drops in the past few missions. Um, I got the feeling that it's going to get nasty in, in the upcoming missions. So, yeah, this is a pilot bailout, I guess. All right. Uh, let's see what we got here. Three archer parts. Hunchback. Two vulture parts. Okay, I can't say no to those. The RPPC Magna. I'm going to go down here. I want to see if there was anything that could have been on that. Oh, there's a streak MRM-30. We need ammo for it, though. Um, thumper artillery. That was probably on the hunchback. ECM. I don't see anything here immediately. Heat bank. That's kind of nice. So now I think heat banks and um, exchangers reduce incoming heat damage. Yeah, 30% heat resistance. So if you're getting hit by flamers, you reduce the damage from flamers. Which is kind of nice. Prototype double heat sink. Oh, tracker sensors. Man. Turret mount. So much good stuff. Yeah, I can't see what that could have been. Thumper ammo. Yeah, there's streak SRM. Streak MRM ammo too. Now here's the problem. Do we... take the streak MRM and hope we get the ammo or do we just go ahead and how much does that streak MRM weigh because that could be like 13 tons so 15 tons with the ammo where does it go though Man, I so I really want to take this. I don't know if it's the right idea right now, though. I mean, we could just take the the streak MRM ammo, and then when we get the vulture, hopefully, fingers crossed, hopefully, um, we keep one of the streaks. Because the way I'm finding it now is I'm finding it harder to find the right ammo more so than I am to find a finding a weapon system so I'm gonna take the ammo over the actual weapon system but I'm gonna I definitely want to keep these two parts I definitely want these two parts so we're gonna confirm this okay large laser we don't need small VSPL 50 damage two tons 300 what decrease damage and heat the further you move so if you're not moving I'm gonna hang out of that another 280 core 180 we don't need got two of those already this can go we'll hang on to the ballistic the mask we've already got one of these so let's lose this one Dead fire ammo is always a win. Streak SRM we'll hang on to because we picked up a streak in the last episode. Or the, maybe it was one before that. Um, yeah, so I think we made out okay. I wish we got more mech parts on this, but that's actually not too bad. Alright, 32,000 repairs. Not bad for a three and a half skull. Or was that a th that was the three skull, right? Yeah, that was the three skull. We got the three and a half. Well, that was the three and a half, yeah. So I think we should, our second Lance would have probably been able to handle that one. Maybe. 
We would have been into more direct fire. That vulture may have posed the threat, but the mortars could have probably shredded it by the time it got close enough. Especially with the bushwhacker helping, and now with the uh, centurion, we would have been able to put some heavy fire down on it real fast. So yeah, I mean, yeah. So distraction, I think we should be able to do. There's two lances, so we should be able to do that with our, our second lance. So we'll do that next episode. And then we may clean this one up. But if we can get enough rep with these guys here, um, like I don't think we have access to anything special in the store right now. Like there's no option. I guess I have to look for MMO3s in the store. Armored cow. Anything? I, don't, I think I've already checked this store. I don't think there's any, here anything we want or anything we can actually buy. PPC capacitor is nice, but I'm not spending a million for it. We're hanging. We're going to be upgrading the Argo, so I want to hold on to this. Heavy rack five, seven shots. Wow. Um, LBX ammo, LRM ammo, mortar ammo, SRM dead fire ammo, which we've already got lots of. So yeah, not a lot here, but you can see what I mean about it's like it's very rare you'll find those bits and pieces of ammo that aren't really really common like finding MRM, MRM ammo in the store I've been finding is really difficult and any kind of specialty ammo like incendiary or whatever I've been finding hard to find as well so if it's MRM incendiary it's even harder to find but yeah uh, I'm going to leave this episode here but first before we do that I want to check the mech bay because I thought Maybe I'm wrong. Did we encounter a vulture? Or I might see. I got another series, not series, but a game that I play on the side when I'm really too tired to record. Uh, let's go to heavy. Yeah, no, we don't. Maybe it was that game I was thinking of. Yeah, because I play a game on the side when I'm too tired or it's too hot to record. So uh, it could have been in that one. Yeah, I want to put this bushwhacker together too. That's the other thing. Then we can probably pull up the Min Shen once this is uh, up and running. Um, we can actually just have go ahead and trash this while we're here. Don't want the Crapple Master parts. But we can go through here. I want to trash some of these parts too. Um, I'm probably going to sell the Fire Starter. I'm going to keep the Arrhenia for now. Um, and then just sell a lot of these like lighter mech parts. 25, 20 tonners, 30 tonners. Oh, I don't, well, yeah. Probably just sell them. The urban mech is nice to keep around because every once in a while you get enough parts to put one together and it's just extra money. So it's better to, to save a few. But whatever. Um, yeah, so I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. <laughs> Until next time, we'll see you later.